Hey, and welcome back to another video. Um, I'm just gonna, uh, it's gonna be kind of a short video today. Uh, just a little update. I didn't get to go get the other lizards. Um, they didn't have them at the, uh, reptile shop. So I'm gonna be checking the website periodically and just, um, whenever they get them in, go down and grab those little babies. Uh, I'm probably, I decided to actually get two more because these guys are... You know, they've been in here for a while, and I didn't want to just introduce one and have him be, him or probably he, be bullied and, you know, uh, anything bad happen. So I figured I'd get two from the same place, and they can kind of, you know, acclimate together. <clears throat> um, so yeah, that's probably going to be the plan in the next month or two. I don't really know when they're going to be in season. The people at the reptile place, Triple L... Reptile uh, in Oceanside, they said um, that they didn't know when they were going to get him in. Anyways, I thought I'd do a quick video on uh, my crickets. Uh, I've recently, probably about a week, no, no, a couple weeks ago, I bought a uh, hundred crickets and then they got down to 50 or, you know, a little bit less and then I was like, oh, I was at, I was at the pet store and I was like oh, I'll just buy some more so I got a hundred more so I probably had 200 crickets in this bin and I decided to switch my crickets into a bin because I saw a video and I thought it'd be a lot better to put them in a bin and I surprisingly thought you know they just die at the same rate but they haven't I haven't had a cricket die in a couple days and that's pretty surprising since they they're so small they die they get they that yeah they die kind of fast. Uh, so I just have some like wire mesh, really thin. And I have these little whatever clips, whatever called clips they clips you call them. And then I just swing it back. Um, it's kind of messy in here. Uh, oops. I'm about to feed them. But uh, I have so much egg carton that I think it's insane. I mean, I can't even find the crickets. There's like one over there. But, um, personally, I think the more egg carton, the better, because, I mean, they're, they're really thriving, and, uh, I haven't had a few die. Watch me find a dead one as I talk, as I talk in this video, but that's okay. So they're getting kind of big. I bought them, and they're really, really small when I bought them. Oh, he's alive. Oh, he's dead. That's too bad. I was I cleaned their I cleaned their thing out the other day, so I probably stressed them out a lot, and a couple of them died. I'll get him in a little bit, but I uh, I changed I guess I I set up my crickets here, just like I would set up a reptile. Um, it doesn't bother me anymore touching me either, which is kind of cool. Oh. I should get him out of there. So I just have I have a food bowl there, a water bowl there. Food, not under there. Food right here, and um, a water bowl over there with a rock in it so they don't drown. There's a little. This guy dead too? No, he's not dead. He's just drowning. <laughs> I think uh, when I lift the box up here, the water fell out. But yeah, I just have egg carton galore, and in the middle I have where I'm put like perishable food. There's just some bread crumbs that I threw in there. Uh, but uh, I'm gonna be feeding them lettuce. Just, uh, I just toss it in here. I'll probably break it up a little, put it scattered around. I found that they, um, you know how people say like, oh, use carrots or whatever. My, every crickets I've gotten, or all the crickets, uh, crickets I've gotten, they just don't eat the lettuce, uh, they don't eat the carrots. I think because I buy the smaller crickets, like the, you know, at PetSmart or whatever you go and you say small and they give you like the really tiny ones and so they just don't chew the carrots or do anything with the carrots so I kind of gave up on that and uh, the other day I put some potato in there like these small little small little spuds and I just tossed them in there and they ate those which was cool so yeah I just toss it in there and um, also a tip would be just from experience I'm not like an expert or anything um, I don't breed crickets, I just buy them and feed them for my lizards. 
Um, I got, you know, the tops of the egg carton. Um, I found that the more you cover their food, the more they eat it. Because crickets are, one, very easily stressed out. And two, shy, I guess. Not shy, but they're just... They're annoying. Because I want them to eat, and then they don't eat. But, um, as you can see, there's a lot of poop around. Um, probably going to clean it tomorrow. Uh, but yeah. That's pretty much it about my crickets. And then I just toss this cover back over and roll up the sides. I haven't had any escapees yet. It's about, mm, probably 30 gallon tub. 30, 40 gallon tub. Hmm, probably 20 or 30. I don't know. But yeah, that's pretty much it. And they're, they're doing pretty good. Only two, two dead today. And like I said, it's probably because I stressed them out the other day. Cleaning their little thing because... There's a bunch of crap in there. Crickets are messy. But yeah, that's just my setup for our crickets. It's worked pretty well. And uh, they fatten up really fast. And obviously my little guys love them because they're little terrors. They've gotten super active in their new cage. Like, it's ridiculous. He, oh my gosh. This little dark one over there and the light one right there. They're just doing really well. Uh, yeah, so I probably won't make another video until I get the new one, so I'll see you guys in a little bit. Thanks for all your comments and questions, and the people who subscribed it means a lot to me. Thank you so much, and I'll see you in the next video.